Born of two worlds, I stand at the crossroads of history. The red dust of Mars whispers the legacy of my people, while the blue orb of Earth bears the scars of Martian wrath, its Arctic ice cap melted by the fires of our space fleet. Ages ago, a war not of misstep but of intent, fueled by ambition and fear, set our planets at odds. On Earth, the Martian assault unleashed environmental chaos, melting the ice caps, raising the seas and altering the face of our world. On Mars, we too faced our reckoning. In a bid for dominance, we tore apart our own atmosphere, rendering a once lush planet into a desolate sphere. In the shadows of Olympus Mons, I stand haunted by these acts of war. Yet I dream of a future unbound by the mistakes of our past. No, this cannot be our legacy, not like this. The dreams of millennia, now smoldering in the ashes of conflict. Mars, witness our remorse. Here lies the testament of our conscious wrath, a tale of two civilizations undone by their own hands. May those who come after us heed the lessons of the fall of Mars and Earth. Beneath the Earth's waves lies a secret, a relic predating our war, a vessel that binds our destinies. This ancient craft speaks of a time before our divide, of a thread linking Earth to Mars, echoing the legacy of the Olympians, our shared forebearers. This discovery rewrites our story, urging us to mend the fractured bonds under the stars. Our paths, though marred by the scars of war and environmental devastation, beckon us towards reconciliation. Among the relics of our conflict and the ruins of our worlds, we find the keys to a new dawn. The Baltic Sea anomaly, more than a ship, stands as a beacon a clarion call to understand the depth of our actions and to forge a future that honors both Earth and Mars.